Hello, my name is Tony Lombardi. I'm the head football coach at Cedar Rapids Washington High School. And uh, on behalf of American Football Monthly, we're glad to be with you today. Um, I'm going to have an opportunity to share some things with you today about our pass protection. Um, we, we call this talk holding off the pressure. Um, I've talked in a few other videos this series talking about what we call our fast break offense. Our fast break offense um, requires, we think, a certain amount of implementation enabling you to run a diverse scheme. We've been over the terminology and how to get that done so that you can audible. Basically, at the line of scrimmage, we change, uh, we probably change the play about 70% of the time. Um, and we also have to change our protection along the way. Um, we're going to balance the run in the pass. We're going to be able to attack you on the ground. We're going to spread the defense and take what the defense gives you, depending upon whether they've cho chosen to stack the box, take away our run game, or go out and take away our passing threats out in the perimeter. And I think you have to have an offense that's capable of taking whatever it is that the defense decides to give you on that given week. And uh, obviously, if you're going to do that and be willing to move the ball in the air, you have to be able to somehow keep the pressure off your quarterback. And there's different ways to do that. Obviously, one of them is protection schemes, and that's what we're going to go over today. And then combined into the protection schemes, I think, are the actual routes you run, the depth of your routes, the uh, breaking points of your routes have to be short to intermediate, or you have to throw deep balls in order to let the quarterback get the ball out of his hands quickly. Um, so holding the pressure off your quarterback comes in a lot of different facets, and it's some, some of it is protection, and that's exactly what we're going to go over today, and some of it is your actual passing scheme. Um, where do I come from? Just to give you a little bit of background on what we do uh, here, I've kind of come through a coaching family. My father was a coach, my brother's a coach, my grandfather uh, was a coach, so it's just kind of, I guess they came by it naturally. Um, so when I started coaching way back in uh, 1985, I, I spent a year at the high school level with my father, and then I went on and to the uh, collegiate level where I spent, I think, about 15, 16 years uh, between the University of Wisconsin, uh, Mankato State University, Eastern Michigan University, and then I finished in a professional league called the XFL. Uh, I had an opportunity during the course of that time to work on both sides of the football. I've been a, a defensive coordinator, a special teams coordinator, worked as an offensive uh, assistant coach. So I had an opportunity, I think, which is a good thing, to have some sort of a diverse training uh, as far as working on honing my craft and learning the different aspects of football. And I share that with you so you know that the evolution of this offensive system comes from all those different concepts, offensive and defensive. I think there are a lot of defensive concepts worked into our offensive system. Uh, following that, we became, my family and I decided that the high school game would be something that we would enjoy as a family. We have five children. Um, this gives us an opportunity to get off the road recruiting, spend time at home, and still uh, coach young men. And it's a great game of football, which we all, I think, appreciate being a part of. And, you know, that has been a real a joy for me over the last six years. Uh, and in that six-year period of time, uh, we've been combined uh, 50 and 18, so we've had a certain amount of success over the years, um, and we're, we're pleased with that. Um, in those six seasons, five of those six years, we made it to the playoffs, and uh, four of those fives, we made it to the quarterfinals. Uh, one year, we made it to the semifinals. So, you know, we've had some success. We certainly have some.